Hello everybody, this is Roger with Toots, uh, Tips, Tricks, Reviews, Unboxed. Uh, I, today I'm doing another review and it's going to be another uh, website. It, it's a website that I tried out a little while ago. I haven't been able to use it lately, but that's because I've had to <coughs> back up on a lot of the stuff that I've been doing with audio and video, but this is one of them that I have tried out, and it's called Thing Link, and that's Thing, T H I N G, and then Link, L I N K. And uh, this is my uh, profile, and these are some of the videos or videos and pictures that I've used with it. Now they have an interesting um, an interesting outtake on this stuff uh, and what I like about it I, I, I do actually like it the only thing that I don't like is the upgrade account um, the price is the price for this is outrageously expensive and uh, I don't like the price of it but I do like what it has to offer. It was just hard to use it when you post this stuff on other sites and everything. And uh, it's hard to explain, but uh, before I get into all that, I'm going to go ahead and show you a little bit about it. Um, you have a create option, which is right here, and it's upload an image, upload video upload 360 VR image and import from URL which means you can basically import a video off of the website or a picture off of the website and do what you want to do with it and then you have the option for my media explore and then projects now I believe to get on to my media I have to, yeah come over to your picture or my picture and I click on it and it brings me to another tab and I go into my media well I guess I was already on my media it's been a while since I've been on this site so you have to excuse me um, and uh, right here you have an option for groups statistics my media account settings, uh, blog, webinars, then the upgrade and the logout options. Um, now, my projects are right here. And <coughs> I'll show you some of the things that I've done. I, I believe I've got some stuff here. Yeah, they've changed it. Um, I'll go to a picture first. And this is the one that I have on my uh, my group, The Strange, The Bizarre, The Unusual. I like it. And uh, that deals with uh, ghosts and UFOs and strange and unusual weird things. And so I make videos and, and I have pictures of things that are on the internet. But anyhow, uh, this has a pretty good uh, thing where you can put tags on your photos and you can put tags on your uh, videos too. And those little white dots right here, these are, are what they are. Um, I have a video there. I have a video there. I have one there. And then one here. Now I go and I click on it. And there's my YouTube video right there. And it pops up and it starts playing. Now, like I said, this is a pretty good setup. But the thing of it is, is like uh, when I go to share this on Facebook or something like that, it uh, it it doesn't show the dots, and you're not going to get the motion. Somebody, you have to literally. Whoever is looking at it has to literally click on it.
it's got on there. And like here, the same setup. I believe on some of them I even put tags in them from thing like too on the videos while they're playing, but I'm not quite sure. Of them. somebody's watching this video and they want to read more about it they click on that and it brings them to my Facebook group and they can read about the Agarians or everything about aliens is what the video is called so it brings you here it actually brought me to the video but on the side I made I oh no, there it did brought me to the picture it brought me to my uh, my uh, photo that, that I created of it and if you want to read about them you can read about them right there you see which is pretty good because that means it helps out on different levels you know you got the video which is actually bringing in shares off of the video and then you have I said it, it's really good it's a really good tool when it comes to, to sh uh, 
reach. And I'm big on organic reach. I've mentioned that before. And I uh, wanted to mention this because this is actually a good tool, but this is later on in the editing process for me. You know, after I've done the videos and I've got it all set up the way I want, then I can go through with this. I can put taglines inside of the video and share the video like that. But that is basically the gist of it and you can do it with regular photos you know just take pictures and those little white dots you put them in there and you click on it and it'll show you you know different areas on a map what it, you have live video set up for you know, Acapulco wow they got those free cameras or if they want to look at Acapulco people on the beach you just have that dot sitting there and when they go to click on it then they can watch a live video feed of uh, people on the beach in Acapulco which I think that's pretty cool so for me on a thing link I have to give it a thumbs up um, because of the the things that they have to offer I can't give them a thumbs up with the price though because the price is really really outrageous um, this is how much it costs I'll go ahead and pop it up you get uh, the basic which is free for testing and potential potential of interactive images and then twenty dollars a month which is customized and brand your image measure engagements then a hundred and twenty five dollars a month um, which is billed annually and you it's got drive engagement through all your images and videos 360 degree virtual reality editor then you have custom quote um, this is VIP service and it's ultimate control custom solutions and creative studio now I don't know how much that is priced because that's custom quote um, but that's the prices on them and like I said it's a good program but it's just sickly expensive it's not as expensive as X Splitter or Grammarly but it's up there so my thumbs up on the actual program my thumbs down on the price so I hope you guys uh enjoyed this video if you did please uh, like subscribe and share and thank you for watching and have a good day <laughs>